magical place called Little Golden Bookland. There was once a time when this wonderful place was in grave danger, and then it was that a special group of friends decided to do something about it, and set out on an adventure that none of them will ever forget. Gosh, I wonder what's going on. But Beamer, if your light gets washed out, we won't be able to get in and out of the harbor. What's worse, Harbor Town will be flooded. <gasps> Yikes! I'm afraid you're right. Excuse me, excuse me. Coming through. What's the matter, Beamer? Hi, Scuffy. See that big gap in the breakwater from the last storm? There's a new storm coming, and if that hole isn't fixed, Little Golden Bookland will be all washed up. No problem. I'll fix it. You? <laughs> yeah, me. Yeah, sure. Come on now. Give the lad a break. <laughs> Thanks, Guppy, for offering to help. You're welcome, Beamer. Don't worry. I'll be back. Also, those big folks. Toodle, where's Pokey? Play it again, Katie. <laughs> uh oh, I'm late. Sorry. Come on, Pokey. Scuffy's waiting at the harbor. Wrong, shy little kitten. It's an emergency. There's a big storm coming tonight, and we have a big problem. We have to fix that big hole in the breakwater, or Little Golden Bookland will be in big trouble. For a little guy, he sure talks big. Every time we listen to you, Scuffy, we're the ones that end up in big trouble. Yeah, so are we going to fix that big hole anyway? We can fill it with logs from my firewood car. Nah, they just float away. We could fill it with sand. But the waves will just wash the sand right out again. No, we need something big. Honestly, Scuffy, sometimes I think you have rocks in your head. Rocks? That's it. We need a rock. A big rock to plug the hole in the breakwater. And I know just the place to find one. Cave Town! Jolly are pretty overgrown. And the switch is rusted shut. No problem, Toodle. Pokey? There's nothing stopping us now. I am. I'm not 
not so sure about this. I heard there's a lot of crocodiles in Jolly Jungle. Uh, and on the stairs. We might get lost. What if it gets dark? Yeah! Ah! No problem. Right, Pokey? Right. Huh? Nothing is ever as easy as it seems, especially when you have a big job to do. Yikes! Crocodiles! Crocodiles? I want to go home! Shh! We'll sneak across. Attaboy, Tsuno! I'm behind you all the way! The monsters you can't see are always the most frightening. What a funny looking banana! I've never seen a wiggling banana before. And it's not even yellow. Hmm, cut it out! It's furry. And it talks! That's no banana. That's my friend Pokey. Happy, get me out of here! I'm stuck! No problem. Saggy? Saggy baggy elephant, me pokey little puppy. Scuffy, where are you? Pokey, where are you? before I lose my distemper. Oh, a 
Johnny Scrawny Lion King, President and Demander in Chief of Johnny Jungle, have been medicating on your problem. You can plug the breakwater and save little Golden Book Land with this. Sorry, Tawny. It's the wrong shape, and it's too small. We need a big, round rock. Right. Then I just have to accompany you to Cave Town. You'll need the Tawny Scrawny Lion's brilliant leadership, knowledge, and fearfulness to protect you. <gasps> From what? Oh, the, the dreaded Frogulus Hippocus. Right. I know. You can fix that seawall with some of my coconuts. I wish, but they're just too small. We need a big rock. You're right. We have to go to Cave Town. Storm's building. Say, has anyone seen Scuffy? No. Do you suppose... That crazy Scuffy and his friends went off to look for something to fix the breakwater. Meant it when he said he'd save little Golden Bookland. You think they'll make it back? I don't know, mate. I just don't know. Pets are fun in and out of the tub. Yep. Our friends got separated, but they're still on their way to Cave Town to save little Golden Bookland. We never would have found the way to Cave Town without you, Saggy Baggy Elephant. Ooh. Yeah, thanks for helping us. Huh. That's what friends are for. We are friends, aren't we? Of course.
I was just on. Uh, oh, 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 I, 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 I thought I dropped something down here. <laughs> So our brave adventurers found themselves in the Valley of Falling Rocks. But those are just pebbles. Not mine. Look, it's my most favorite really, really big rock. But you can have it. Wow, it's perfect. on your right wheel friend.
<laughs> Attention, everyone. Little Golden Bookland is saved thanks to Scuffy. Well done, matey. Bravo! Hooray! Hooray! Uh, well, you see, Bima, I had some help. I couldn't have done it without Toodle and Katie. And Pokey, he was there for me every step of the way. And Charlotte O'Kitten, she was so brave. Tawny Scrawny Lion gave us tons of advice. Saggy Baggy Elephant helped all of us. And Baby Brown Bear gave up his favorite rock. I didn't do it. We did. Look! A rainbow! I propose a toast. May we never forget this wonderful adventure. Somebody should write it down. And so somebody did. But it was only one of many wonderful adventures in the magical world of Little Golden Bookland.